Hello everybody and welcome. Today I have more tired voice. I apologize about it, I'm not feeling good. But let's go to the video topic itself for today. So today I will use Huawei P20 Lite and Xiaomi Mi Note 10 Lite. On those two phones I will show you how to find and open the settings in two different methods. Second part of the video will be about how to create a shortcut on your home screen and how to remove the shortcut from your home screen for the settings or any other app. But without me talking too much about stuff, let's just start this video. Shall we? So first phone that I will use today is Xiaomi Mi Note 10 Lite. So first of two methods how to access the sitting shortcut is to scroll down from the top border of the screen down and then you see this gear icon. If you click on it, the settings of the phone shows up. Let's go back to the home screen with pressing back button. Now it depends what kind of style of the home screen do you have. If you have standard screen, then all the application will be on the home screen. But if you have, like me, app draw enabled, which if you slide this arrow up, you see the list of different applications. So on that list, just scroll until you get to the settings and you can just click on it and you get inside the settings of the phone. So what about if you want to create a shortcut from app draw directly to home screen? It is very easy. In the list of the applications, click on the settings or any other app you want to create a shortcut while holding just move it where you want to have it and then just release. Now if I just want to enter settings back again, I will just click on the home screen settings shortcut. So here you have a bunch of different informations and settings for your phone. And now let's go back to home screen and if I want let's say to delete some shortcut or that one that I just created, I just click or tap on it and while holding it the menu shows up and inside this menu I just need to click remove button. Shortcut it is deleted but these settings or application you were deleting it is still persisting inside your phone. To remove it completely you, you would need to do some extra steps. So now let's just go to Huawei P20 Lite. So first method is just to press and hold finger from the top border of your screen and slide it down so you can find this gear icon on the top which is the settings. If you click on it you get into the settings themselves. Now I will just go back to home screen by pressing back button on the bottom part of the screen and when I'm on home screen you can have two possibilities. Home screen can be set as standard or app drawer. If you have a standard all the programs you can find on the home screen. But in my case I have app drawer and how do I know that? Because this button with the dots is for applications to show up. So when I click on it I can scroll among all of the programs that I have and when I get to the settings you can just click on it and you are inside the settings. Now I will just go one step backwards just like before and I'm back to the list of applications. Now I will just make a shortcut to home screen. How to do it? It is pretty easy. Just click and hold settings icon or whatever application you want to make shortcut of and just drag it wherever on the home screen you want it and then just release the finger and that is it. So now if you click on the shortcut you get to the settings of your phone. 
in the settings you have plenty of stuff that you can manage. Now, what about if you want to remove your shortcut of settings or any other program from your home screen if you have App Drawer enabled? It is very easy. Just click and hold your app with the finger and this menu pops up. Now, just click remove and shortcut is gone, deleted. But application or settings shortcut that you deleted still persists in your smartphone. So that was it for today. I hope you liked the video. If you have any questions, did not understood something whatsoever or just say hi, just type everything below this video in the comments. If you want to get notified about new videos, just click subscribe and bell button. Like the video if you like it, dislike it, thumbs down if you did not like it and share with others so others can learn also. So until next time, have a blast people and see ya, bye bye.